So in the comments of my How Arcane Rights Men video, I saw some people asking about Echo. How masculine is Echo? It's an interesting question because in terms of his image, he's muscular but also small and scrawny. Societal role, he's like a political leader sort of, but of a relatively weak faction. Personality, very serious and macho, but also very boyish. And this all reminded me of his nickname as a kid. Little man. I'm always on the lookout for these different ways Arcane expresses the burden of inferiority in its Undercity characters. Whether this inferiority has colored their whole outlook on life, or whether it's affected them in physical ways or mental ways. With Echo, the whole of Echo's community depends on the leadership and protection of a boy. The boy savior! The setup of everything with Echo is that he has the essence of what he needs, but nothing else. He has a weak body that's as strong as he can get it, but still... He's still punched like a little boy. He has this tech that works well enough, but isn't safe. So Little Man, I think, is highlighting his immense duty along with his limitations. He's definitely a man, but he's held back by a lot. It's a unique expression of the Undercity struggle of not having enough, how poverty often forces ill-suited people to step up and take responsibility, because if they don't, who will?